Brendan from Panic at the Disco. Hello. We meet again. This is gospel for the fallen ones locked away in permanent slumber. Give me the short version of your journey from then till now. Because it's not in the afternoon. I'm exactly where you might be. Closing the damn door. Things have changed for me. Yeah, we've lost some members, gained some new members, uh, put out a few more albums. Um, I, feel like I, I was married. I got no, married this year. I feel like you're a, you're a different guy. Am I? Yeah. That's, I guess that's in good. In a good way, not in a bad way. A little bit older, yeah. I mean, I still feel 18 you up feel here. you feel like you were like a little bit of a brat? I was definitely a brat. If you love me, let me go! The new album, which comes out October 8th, Too Weird to Live, Too Rare to Die. Yeah. Quite a statement you made on the first two videos and the first two songs. Like, much more like in your face and I feel like you've got <laughs> some aggression or something you want to get out of your system here. Yeah, there's some visceral nature behind it. Um, I mean, all the songs are really confessional. They're, you know, honest stories that put into song form. It's just uh, stuff I actually went through. But I wanted to, um, you know, be able to revisit these memories without having to be pained too much by, you know, the memory of it all. So it just kind of, it worked out for the best. I like being honest in lyrics, and I like being able to keep it exciting in the recording process and, and try new stuff we haven't before. And the videos, yeah, I think came out great. They're just really a lot, a little darker than the song sound, I think, which is always fun to do. seems like very much you. Mm -hmm. You're on the cover, you're only in the videos, the other band members aren't anywhere to be found. Is that an intentional thing or? Yeah, it was intentional. We talked about some of our favorite records to influence the album art, and a lot of them were like, you know, David Bowie, and I don't know, there were just a bunch of different things where it was, it was the singer on the front, and it was really powerful, like Hunky Dory by David Bowie was just really great, him like in these gowns, like very, you know, feminine, but kind of just this beautiful shot. And I don't know, I was really influenced by a lot of that stuff. So yeah, it just made sense. And, and they're and fine they're, with it? Yeah, they're good with it. They they don't mind. 